here was a very good one. Thank you. Yes. Thank you very much. Oh, my princess is back. <laughs> oh, my princess. Honey. <laughs> oh, you're welcome. You shall live long. You see. Right. You're beautiful at this day. You're welcome. Thank you so much. How was the journey? It was beautiful. And how was the trip? Oh my goodness, it was beautiful. But you know, a little bumpy here and there, but fine. <laughs> <laughs> good. Oh, you are welcome back. Thank you so much. <laughs> it's good to see you. Uh, <laughs> um, Daddy, I think I'm really tired. I have to return to my room to have my dessert rest. <laughs> good idea. Okay, Daddy. Then we'll talk some more later. Okay, huh? okay Daddy. <laughs> My wife, my sister, my daughter all rolled into one. <laughs> <laughs> Considering the fact that I have been chasing her over the years, even back in the university. <laughs> so it's about Neka. That you've not been answering your, your, the call I've been calling you for a while. Please go and ask her. You know her house, not me. She's your She's my friend. Come on, John. Do I look like Neka to you? Don't you know Neka again? <sighs> Please, I saw your mom at the market. She gave me these vegetables for you so you could add them to the soup for your afternoon meal. Since she won't be back early. If you like, prepare the soup and eat. If you don't like, sit here and be bobbing your head over in Here, have it. Down. I'm not being able to do it. 
I don't know if I forgot girlfriend. It's just that I've been busy running errands up and down here and there in the Even yesterday I thought I could do it for you. John's mother will lead me in the market with a message for John. Huh? And come on, we're talking about John. Here. Yeah. How did John find his way into this conversation? Eh, uh, just that he's not letting me rest. We were talking about my clothes that you were meant to teach for me. You just stop what this John talk now. Sorry. It's just that yesterday when I saw him, he was very miserable. Very, very miserable. It's not about me. It's not about you that we've been talking about. That is none of my business. We were talking about... It's a human being that we're talking about here. A person's feelings. This guy was interested in you all through the university. And he made it clear to the exclusion of every other girl. But he hardly looked his way. You're my friend though. And I believe that down deep inside that place you like that guy. Because I know you very well. Stop pretending. You like him. What? So, what's wrong? What's the problem? <laughs> yes or no? Do you like John or not? Eh, yeah, I like him, but... <laughs> okay, so, what's wrong? John is nice, he's brilliant, he's cool, he's responsible. Even I'm using company. So, what's the problem? Do you know that <laughs> these days we have to be careful of all these boys? You never can tell. I'm just trying to be very careful. And you're right, so I think you should give him a try out. Just, just give him a chance. Yeah, whatever. It's it's left for me to decide that. After all, it's my life. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, that pill is Cassava and stop talking too much. Every time, John, 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 John. If you like him, go for him. Are you not a girl? People peel this Cassava. I chew it one. I'm true now. First, you're there. It's in, in, in a magical. My father is fine, your highness. He sends his greetings. Ah, good, good, good guy. Is that yes, good? Yes, yeah. Please sit down. Yes, I want to go. Uh, come and meet uh, this uh, young man sitting beside you. Um, this uh, the Dibono, the Crown Prince of Idemiri Kingdom. He has come to see you. I am delighted to meet you. Um, aside the whole title thing, what's your actual name? My real name, I am Prince Ikenga Chibula of Idembili Kingdom. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Neka. I... 
Me staring at you doesn't imply madness. It implies interest. Interest in who? In you. Eka, please. Give me a chance in your life. John. John, I can't. I mean, you guys are all the same. You are not reliable. No. All men are not the same. You've known me since childhood. Have you ever seen me with any girl? Or oh. even heard? John. John, leave me alone. Leave me alone, please. Leave me. Neka. something about your parents, like um, yeah. how's your father and your parents, everybody? Mm, well, they were fine. Are you serious? Mm. <laughs> they're just the most beautiful house I've ever been to. Are you serious, Brian? Your father has a bigger plus than this one. Yeah, he does, but you can't compare it with this one. Are you serious? <laughs> Just see what my father did about that. Like, just came and just responded to my father's ear. Just like that. Is it duty call? It's crazy. Um. Appointments that is written all over you. When he didn't do his usual thing, me, Moa, disappointed. Hey, look, Neka, eh, we've been friends for ages. Uh -huh. When will you understand that? Stop pretending. I don't see anything that is wrong with you letting your head down and being friends with Vega, 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 see me. You, you know where all these things will lead. You know. Look, Neka, eh, relax and live for once. <laughs> Eh? It's not as if you're preparing for a nunnery or something. Do you want to be a nun? You choice she's sister. Mm. Not to meet your sister. Huh? Come on, John, 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 John. What is it? I oh. told you before. If you like him, go for him. I don't like him now. That means you don't want you to don't get married. Like him. You don't like him. Why, why, are you why are you telling me? Why you telling me? You don't want to get him? married. You want to end up in a brother's house. Are you not a girl? Is he your brother? He's not my brother, but he's okay for you now. Am I not your friend? I want the best for you. Auntie John. Okay, you want the best for me. Yes. He's not the best for you. If you go, he didn't see yourself. Me now. He was running after Leave you. Me alone. Is it that you want? You end up in your father's house now. I won't talk to you about this issue again. Ah, would you? 
Are you looking for Sister Anne? No, no, no. no. She's just left. No, I'm not looking for her. She's already home. She sent me to bring those thing, items for your mother. She said she forgot to bring them along when she came. Oh. Mama is in the back. At the back, yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. And June, what's happening between you and my friend Inek? What's happening? When it seems you are showing interest, you're acting uninterested. I guess everybody have their limits. Now I have reached my limit. I tried. I guess it wasn't good enough. It's a real pity. But keep on trying. She might change her mind. Right. Let me see, Mama. Like, I guess what? What? Why are you laughing? I, I just finished telling you something now. It's funny. It's funny. Yeah. Ne. Guess what? Guess now. What? <laughs> Storyteller. What? Okay. Let me help you. Sister Anne is taking me to Lagos. Hmm? She said she will help me get a space in Johnson and Maja PLC. Are you serious? Hey, hey. Oh. I'm joking. How lucky for you, my friend. Lucky. Yeah. I know how you feel. Hmm? Don't worry, alright? I, I talked to her about you. She said that this opportunity comes once at a time. That she will bear you in mind. And I always remind her, okay? We'll be leaving tomorrow morning. I'm going to miss you. I'll miss you too. I'm going to miss you so time. much. Don't worry. Come. Don't worry. I'll miss you very much. You'll be fine. We'll keep you in touch. I know right? we'll keep in touch, but no problem. Thank God I have John to keep me calm. Just be yourself. Just be yourself. Alright? We'll be fine. I'll miss you. Don't cry. I know you can cry. Don't start crying. Right. Oh, oh, come on, baby. Give me my last hug. Baby. <laughs> Hey, come, 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 come. Haven't paid me now. I'm coming. Come, I know the sand. How many gallons did they fetch? Now five. All right, bring your money now. Young fuller. Hey. No change. One is twenty naira. I will give you my change, my brother. Yes, sir. That's what we stay for the long one. How many gallons did they fetch? Five. Master. Give me your money now. Five. Yeah. How many? You don't. You don't do food. How much? You gotta fill this small gallon there for me. Ten, ten naira. That one. Now, five naira. Since I saw you at the ball. <laughs> John. Look. Neka, my intentions for you are very honorable. And that is why I have had so much patience over, over the years. But I have noticed your 
reservations and I want to propose that we stay as friends. Your mistress. She said she had an important appointment she could not afford to miss, Your Majesty. Can I take any messages for her, sir? Yeah. 
I understand how you feel. Let me handle it, please. I just don't understand. Honestly. And to make matters worse, she won't even tell me what the problem is. I just woke up this morning to this insulting nonchalance. You know what? We'll get to the bottom of this. I promise you. What did you do about? I can't say it. <laughs> no. Please tell me. <laughs> well, um it was strange. You were touching me everywhere and I was making some funny noises. It was beautiful though, but Jay, uh -huh. is that how it normally is? Well, I guess when you do it with someone you love. Mm. Well, I... Uh... What? Nothing. What? Nothing. Okay. Do you want to talk about this inside? Hmm. Stand up there. No, they've gone to the market and will not be back till evening. No problem. Let's go in. Alright. Yes. How are you, my dear? Uh, I'm fine, Daddy. Alright. Well, you look a little bit under the weather. No, I'm, I'm fine. <laughs> are, you, are you sure? Yeah, I'm actually not fine. I'm doing great. Um, in Kenga, I haven't seen him lately. Is something wrong? Um. No, no, Dad. I think he's drunk. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I'm sure. <sighs> Come on, Dad. I mean, things like this happen. People don't have to see each other all the time. Yeah, yeah. It's just that uh, Ezemwa sees it uh, differently. Don't mind Ezemwa, okay? Don't mind him. I mean, he's neither Ikenga nor me. He's only guessing, Daddy. Yeah, yeah. Yes, you're right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're right. Nah. Yes, dear. Was it really painful yesterday? <laughs> Little. I got sweet later. <laughs> okay. Um I'm I'm happy you like it. Jay. Mm-hmm. That's my love. Did you enjoy? <sighs> it 
it was like I wasn't even on earth. I felt like I was out of this world and gone to heaven. <laughs> Good afternoon. Nick, where are you coming from? I'm going to see a friend. A friend? Yes, Mama. Nick, sit down here. Sit down here. Mama, I say you should sit down. Nick, what is going on between you and the boy and son? Mama, he's just my friend. We're just friends. That's all. He's your friend? Eh. Yeah. That is it, eh? Why do you people have decided to make themselves the talk of the town? Eh? Why? Mama, we're just friends, that's all. Get to let your father know here about this nonsense so. Let him not get to know about it too. Neck. Okay, mm -hmm. Mama. I've heard. Nothing is happening between us. We're just friends. Let me help you. We're just friends now. Nothing is happening. Mama, can't I just be friends with anybody? <laughs> Eh, neck, neck. Hmm. Eh. Nice one we're having for lunch. Hmm. Ah. Cool. Don't forget our friend. I'm telling them that that boy can run for his good. I tell you, I can bet on him. I will bet on that. Can one for can one for the time? Yeah, can one. You will not understand. Papa, Mama, I'm going to see a friend. Neka, sit down. Neka, sit down. My father said you should sit down. Neka. Papa. I'm not comfortable with the stories I'm hearing about you. What is going on between you and that boy that is following you around the village? Oh. Papa, he's my friend now. Hmm? Friend? Okay. Come on, you, bro. My friend. Friend indeed. Neck. Neck. Papa. Hola, Neck. Have you seen your daughter? Neck. I and your mother cannot misguide you. You must stop seeing that boy. <gasps> Neka, you must stop seeing that boy. Oh. Neka, keep quiet and listen to your father. Keep quiet and listen to him. Oh. Every time I'll be talking about something, she will not listen. And I have been expecting you that you should be telling this girl what to do in the right condition. No, I've been talking to her. I've been talking to her long ago. Neka, Neka. Neka! Sit down, sit down. You see what I have been telling you? Neka! You see what I have been telling you? Mama, we died to know. Why are we not just friends? He's my friend. You are not the only beautiful girl who. You're not the only beautiful girl, though. Can't I have friends again? Hold on to yourself, though. You see it? Afternoon, sir. Yeah, good afternoon. How are you, my son? Fine. Thank you, sir. I guess uh, you are the one my daughter, Neka, is coming to see this afternoon. Is it not? Um. Come on, my son. Just tell me the truth. Tell me the truth. Yes, sir. And uh, remind me that your name. John. John. Yes. And uh, I guess you are here to see her possibly go out with her. You're welcome. 
Let me let me call her for you. Eh? Let me call her. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Because I don't have a job, that's why they are chasing me, chasing me. Well, you didn't say anything like that. But, but it's the truth. It's the truth. I need, I need to do something. It's about time. You know, I, I will talk to my friend, Jonathan. Yeah. He told me about some vacancies the last time I spoke to him, about some places that he checked out. Yeah. I'll go and find him. I'm getting to used to this village life. Oh. Oh. Yeah, I remember you told me about this Jonathan guy, but you told me he can provide you with accommodation. And you know, in cases like this, you have to hang out in town for a day or two. How will you cope? Be fine. Oh. I'll be fine. Hello? No, you will not believe what happened to me today. I went to one of the places that Jonathan talked, told me about, and they were writing their aptitude test. Yeah, I, I joined in. Oh my God, Jay. Let God answer our prayer and let him employ you. Uh, they even said we should, we should stay and get, get the results. So I'm even waiting now. All right. I'll be expecting your call, okay? And I'll be praying for you. Just take care of yourself. Bye. No, bye. Let him employ him. My dear, I really, really like you. <laughs> I do. I already know that, Obisi, but uh, 
The feeling is not mutual. Oh, never mind. Those things don't happen in a flash. And besides, love takes his time to mature. Okay? But in the meantime, I have to take you to my father's palace for you to see what I got. Is this what you've been doing behind me? Is this really what you're up to? <gasps> you two timing traitor! Don't dare insult her before me. You don't dare. She has found favor in my eyes. And you must get used to that. Stay clear. All, all what? All what? Ah. I am not surprised. No. You know why I'm not surprised? This is what your father did, and he had it hot. If you look at me, you are now a very gentle prince. So, wasting my time. With an arrogant and a lunatic prince like you. I think you I don't know what I'm doing. So the best you got to do for yourself is this. Stay clear. And be warned. Be warned. <laughs> be warned. Neka. Thank you. I I missed you. Oh, to mine was so bad. How did everything go? Is everything completed already? Uh, all right. It was fine. There's a little process though. There is one more interview that we have to do. But I see it as a, a formality because they are saying those who are coming should just come with their their bags. So I think I, it, it's still a, a head on, but I'll be fine. <laughs> so did you, did you miss me? Oh my did I miss you? So much. Ah, oh, no, I'm home alone. Okay. So, I'm going to get you something. My dear, are you connected to the confrontation between Prince Ikenga and Prince Obiese yesterday in my throne room? No, Daddy. No. I mean, these two men are just uncivilized men that cannot compete over a woman without rancor over her. Daddy, I blame you for this. I totally blame you for this. Me? Yes. I, how? Oh, Daddy, you always keep matchmaking me all the time. And there is bound to be problems if you do that. Mm. Mm. Uh, all right, uh, I'll stop. Good. Jay, 
you worried? My love. I was just a wondering. How am I going to cope without you? And the place is so far. Hmm. Jay, I feel the same way too. But I console myself with the fact that we will at least be talking on the phone. Jay, what we should be doing now is pray for you. You know it's not easy to get a job in the city. Jay. Yes, my love. I'll always be there for you. I know. I'm, I'm counting on it. And I will always belong to you. Thank you, Jay. Thank you. successful architectural outfit in this town. Meaning we didn't get that far by being lazy and we hope you're not. No, I'm not lazy, sir. Good. Very hard working. I want to believe you've been given a copy of the company rules. Yes, yes, sir. I wanted to study and understand every one of the rules. If you fail, anyone will fail the employment. Uh, on that note, I would want you to come to be around on Friday so I could introduce you to the Chairman, Chief Executive Officer of the company on Friday when we'll be having our board meeting. I want you to dress well. <laughs> yes, sir, I will. From here, you go to the welfare department. Um, you'll be given some allowance to start with and then they'll show you your accommodation. Yes, yes, sir. Do you have any other? Um, not at this time, sir. Okay. So, thank you very much. See you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, Highness, I 
I'm very delighted to introduce this young man standing here before this honorable board. Um, we just employed him as the newest member of the house. Yeah, yeah. You're welcome, young man. Thank you, Your Highness. And what's your name? John Okoye. Thanks. Mr. Okoye, you're welcome. Thank you, Your Highness. I started this company. And uh, together with my, my son here, my daughter, and my late wife, we are all architects. And they were my first employees. I'm telling you this because I want you to know that for us, architecture is not only a profession, but a passion and a way of life. Do you understand? Yes, Your, your Highness. So I would like you to pull your weight. Work very hard as if this company belongs to you and your family. And I promise you that you will be well paid. Yes, Your Highness. Thank you, Your Highness. And uh, oh, by the way, I would like you to see me tomorrow evening. Yes, and come with you, the blueprint. You give it to me. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. All right. Thank you, Your Highness, uh, I'm looking for His Majesty. Thank you, Your Highness. Okay. Did he say why? 
Elsa. Elsa. Okay. Thank you, sir. How are you cooking with your new job? Oh, it's, it's good. I, I, I like it. Okay. Thank you, Your Highness. Oh, please. Just call this Highness stuff, okay? I mean, it's beginning to sound like a chorus. My name is Adaisy, but um, if you're not comfortable calling me Adaisy, you can call me Princess. Okay. Go ahead. Princess. There you go again. <laughs> um, I um, give an instruction that... um. I should get you something like um, a refreshment of your choice. Oh, I'm I'm fine, you I'm Princess, I'm fine. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, since you said that um, your new place is good and you're enjoying the new place, one of these days I'll just drop by and see how you're settling in. That would be nice. I'll, I'll be on it. Yeah. On it. Yes, like uh, exalted, <laughs> privileged. Oh my goodness, stop, please just stop, stop, okay, stop. It's okay. <laughs> What do I do now? God, what do I do? I can't even talk with John on the phone so he will know what has happened. At least he would have given me some good advice. Hey, why is his phone never available? Even a juice number is also never available. God, I don't want to kill this child. But even if I want to, where is the money for an abortion? I'm in trouble. Surprise. <laughs> I didn't think uh, you meant it. Why not? Well, I I just didn't think you would grace my humble abode <sighs> with your presence. <laughs> John, you're actually very good with words, you know. Um, 
I can see that you're really busy this morning. I'm trying to finish my house chores because there's a lot of work at the office. Okay. Let me see how, how far I can go today. Okay, that's very good. I'm very ready then. Can I see how far you go? It's dusty in there, princess. Are you trying to say that my nose hasn't smelled dust since I was born? John? Well. Well, can I see it? Yeah, I heard. Um, stay here, okay? Daddy, I would like to stand, please. Now tell me, what is this I hear about you and the new architect? Daddy, am I not allowed to make friends? I mean, he's just my friend. Is that why, isn't, isn't why she called me a fool? Is that why did you call your sister a fool? Um, well, uh, Daddy, I... Isn't why I admitted you called me a fool? Just say it, you did. It's not fair. It wasn't fair of you. Daddy, please, excuse me. Let her be. I said let her be. I'm fine, Daddy. now I've noticed that you sleep at almost every hour of the day yesterday morning we were discussing and you suddenly ran outside to vomit Nega. tell me the truth you are pregnant eh? mama I'm not pregnant oh. hmm. I know why I'm asking you this it's for me to tell your father before he finds out himself. Because by the time he does, you know he will beat me along with you. You know how your father can be when he's angry. Neg, are you pregnant? Eh? Mama, I'm not pregnant. No, I'm not pregnant. Ah. Could be fever or something. I'm not pregnant, Mama. Mama, have you finished? Eh, so that you can sleep, eh? But it's not late already. Look you. I want to sleep all. So I'm going to sit and blink now your face. So by the next week, you will have to be at Eket. There is this land our client has decided to build on, and we need someone from in-house to go and see the lay of the land, since we've been given the freedom to build whatever appropriate for the land. All right, sir. And take a good look at the land and uh, drop something suitable for us to work on. Yes, sir. The blueprint will be sent to you in due course. I think that will be all for now. Thank you, sir.
Traveling on the weekend. I want to see a friend at the cocktail for I hope all is well. Oh, yeah, all is well, all is well. <laughs> yes. Now I would like you to make me a promise. Okay, and what is the promise of the past? That uh, you will bear in mind the fact that you are no longer in the United States <laughs> as you make this trip. Okay. I promise. That's my girl. <laughs> what are you doing? Well, I'm trying to create. To create something unique. I'm just about to start. I'm still, if you like, I'm still uh, getting my thoughts together, my picture, yes. <laughs> As usual. Yes, because uh, we, it's got to be an extraordinary house. Well, the wind, you know, uh, oh yes, must have access okay. to come in. Okay. You know, and the as big as this. Uh, not necessarily. It doesn't have to be this big okay. to be well ventilated. Okay. Oh yes. But well, you know, we discussed it of the course, other time. Of course, of course, I understand. I understand. As a matter of fact, every time I see your work, I'm excited. <laughs> Of course. Oh, yeah, you're better I, than I am. No, 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 Daddy, no, you Honestly, you, you are. You taught me all, I mean, oh, I learned a lot of things from you. Uh, you were my student. Oh, you know more thing. than I know. <laughs> like father, like God. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, I have to go and not disturb your work. All right, my dear. Okay. Let's <laughs> uh, hmm. see what we can um, must hear now. Hey. Dear Daddy and Mommy, I have decided to say the truth. I am pregnant. The mortal terror of what Daddy would do to me prevented me from saying it all along. Daddy, Mommy, please don't look for me. I have gone to town to search for work so that I can take care of my child and myself. Goodbye. I love you. Your daughter, Nega.
surprise? Yeah, I um, I love surprises. I see. How did you know I will be here? <laughs> uh, well, anyone the one that looks at the weekly calendar in the office would know that uh, you've been a cat this weekend. And also, this is the only project we have in ECAT, developing in ECAT right now. You're right. You're right. But, uh, why would you want to go through all that trouble? Oh, my goodness, you asked too many questions too quickly. Well, I won't blame you. I'll blame the sun that is really hitting down on you. I guess it's really hot. <laughs> and with no mercy. Well, um, I think you need a break. Yeah. Let's go catch a drink together. It's not a bad idea. I I need a, a break myself. Okay. It's really hot, you know. Ah, oh, so how is work? Good. Uh so you still haven't answered my question. Oh that. Before I answer that, I would like to ask you a question. Why do you have a very low opinion of yourself? Yeah, you really do. Seriously, you actually do. Um, in other words, you are saying you actually came here because of me? Are you surprised that I did? I actually do. I guess you also find it very difficult to believe if I tell you that the day you were staring at me at the palace, I was actually aware of it. I actually liked what I saw when I looked at you. Okay. Um. John, I am. Um, I. I actually want to tell you that um, I'm actually attracted to you. I I think we should take this a bit further, you know. Um. So um. <laughs> Where, where are you lodging and what hotel are you staying at? Um, Crystal Royal Hotel. Okay. And, and you? Oh, yeah. Um, I have not found a place to stay yet, but um, I think I'll check out your hotel. And if I like it, I'll stay there. <laughs> but is it really a nice place? Yes. Nice place. You see this? Like they have like jacuzzi baths and um, like the whole house of space and balcony and verandas. Well, I, it's comfortable for me. I don't know if you would like it like that. Yeah, 
food is good. Oh really? I'm serious. That is that mm -hmm. really good? Huh? Huh? How yes. good is that? <laughs> <laughs> it's uh. Sorry, Mama. We did our last interview yesterday. Even as I speak to you this morning, those shortlisted have started work. Yeah. There's no more vacancy. But from what I see of your credentials, you deserve a better work than that. Yes, it's coming. So didn't I give instructions yesterday that the applicant board be removed from defense? You did, sir. And what happened? I instructed the gate man just as you told me. Now go back and tell him that I said that the board be removed from defense immediately. Yes, sir. And make sure he does it in your presence. No, 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 no. Please help me. I don't have anywhere else to go. It doesn't matter. Please, no. please, please. Alright, just stand up. Stand up. Stand up. Sit down. Sit down. What's the matter with you? Didn't you enjoy yourself as much as I did? Hmm? I... Just feel guilty. Oh, God. About all of this. Why? Why are you feeling guilty? It's not as if you're a, you're a priest or something. You don't have to feel this way, okay? I I have a girl in the village that is faithful to me. Oh please, just stop it and relax, okay? Just relax, you'll be fine. Alright? You'll be fine. Just enjoy the variety. I don't want to compare Nika to anyone. Mom, sweetheart, listen to me and listen carefully. 
look at you, look at how handsome and all with this your masculinity and Ben Matthews skill from one village girl. Oh no. Sweetheart, I want my share. Huh? You know, I'm going to have it. But I just had one round of hot sex. Huh? I just had one right now. job more befitting to your academic qualification. I'm grateful all the same, sir. For so, the advanced payment, accommodation and everything. Thank you very much, sir. It's all right. It's our way of uh, motivating more cars around here. Thank you. You're welcome. It's all right. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
hear this. I'm begging the name of God, please. How can I fend for this child without an employment? How can I fend for this child? You know your father listens to you. <laughs> your eyes, please. And he may change his mind, his mind if you plead on my behalf. Please, your eyes, I beg you. Where is this father of this child? He disappeared after the king discharged us from his presence. Okay, Chico. You knew the rules, didn't you? I'm asking you a question. You knew the rules, didn't you? Yes, Your Highness. <laughs> Wait, it was the devil's handbook, please. <laughs> <laughs> really? The devil's work, you say? Okay, Chico, there are two things I don't like. Two things. Waiting of favors and fools, okay? So before I open my eyes, get out of my presence! Please, Your Highness, please. Hey, Your Highness. I said, leave my please, presence. Please, Your Highness, please. Go ask! Please, Your Highness, you go ask! Your Highness, please. It's not for anything. Go ask, where are you? Please, You're not for anything. I've served you for years. Please. I've served you faithfully. I've never had for what? Please, Your Highness. Please. Hi, Les. Please. Please. Okay, you can just leave my presence right now. I said leave my presence. I'm not joking with you. Please, I beg you, Hi, Les. Please.
You were busy frolicking with her. But you! Don't touch me! It's a pity that you are the father of my child, but so be it. John, get out. Get out, my friend! John, get out! I can explain. Get out. Just get out. John! John, I said good afternoon. John, I'm talking to you. John! John, listen, I said good afternoon. John! John, I'm... Why? Why should I acknowledge your greetings when you have ruined my life? Okay, what have I done this time? Neka works for you, for your father. She works in your father's company. And she, she knows all about us. Oh, I see. So that Felix and Lorelia has come to town and wants to destroy my relationship. But you know what? I've got good news for you. Because that serves my purpose beautifully. What? I think you, you've missed the point. You've missed the point. I love that girl. And I want to... To marry her. No, sweetheart. You missed the point. I am serious about you and I want to marry you. Possible. It's not possible. You, you blue blood. You royalty. I'm, I'm a commoner. Your, your parents have plans for you. It's not possible. Sweetheart, don't worry about my parents, okay? My parents will come around when I put my foot down about us, okay? Don't worry about them. Sweetheart. It's late now. Nega is pregnant for me. Oh, she is? I'm also pregnant for you too. What? What? Yes! I am carrying a child, George. I am pregnant. Or oh, do you expect me to go around town and carry another trophy? I am pregnant, baby. I, I am pregnant for you. <sighs> okay, baby. I'm serious. Come here. Don't be angry. I know you're pissed. Come, baby. You. Okay, Che. I've been thinking about your situation. And I think I might be able to help you. Oh, Your Highness. I'm grateful. Mm -hmm. Thank me, yes, okay? Because I won't be begging my father to receive you back, okay? I won't be begging him on your behalf, mind you. Then, how do you intend to do that, Your Highness? Since you said I can't fend for your child, I'll be giving you 250,000 naira 
to adopt your child. And you know what? I need you to do me one more thing. I need you to keep your mouth shut. Otherwise, I'll be forced to cancel the deal. Oh, no, 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 Your Highness. I'll cooperate. I'll keep my mouth shut. I'll call you on the phone to meet me at the venue of my choice. I'll see how you're doing and I'll advance your payment. After the baby is delivered and transferred, the payment will be completed. Do you understand? Good. I hope we've come to an agreement now. Yes, you are. Good. You can leave. Thank you, Your Highness. I summoned you here. What's happened? Why is she crying? <laughs> Ezewa, you were right. You were right. There was something between her and the architect. Dad, I don't understand. Ezemwa, your sister is pregnant for that uh, commoner. Oh, yeah. Don't. Isn't what? I love him. I want him. Shut up! Shut up! Dad, I'll skin that idiot alive. I'll skin him alive. You will do no such thing, okay? You will do no such thing. What was the meaning of all this? I love him. Dad, did you hear that? God. Dad, you have to suck him. He has violated the laws of the company regarding sex. He has to leave. No. The rule says employee to employee. I am a contractual worker and not an employee, you blockhead! As I Yeah, Mr. Martins, I'll be back in the next 20 minutes. Ah, uh, Doctor. Sorry oh. for keeping you waiting. Oh, no, 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 no. It's all right. Are you okay? As you can see, I'm, I'm okay, I'm fine. Um, Ada? Well, you look worried. Is there any problem? No, I'm actually fine, thank you. I'm, I'm sorry for keeping you waiting and thank you for coming at short notice. That's all right. Uh, <clears throat> Doctor. Yeah? There is something I want to discuss with you. And what's that? You know, as the family doctor in the palace, you have my father's ears. What am I about to discuss with you right now? I don't want my father to know about it. It will earn you 500,000 Naira. But if you fail, I will make so much noise that my father will relieve you of your duties in the palace. Did you invite me here to insult me or what? Oh, please sit down, okay? Sit down, okay? Good money is not made with aggravation. I'm only giving you the, all the options. Okay, okay. Can I know, can I know about this project? <laughs> Not until you make up your mind. Because once I tell you, you're in. Watch 